Focal intermediate epileptiform discharges are specific to a localized area of the brain and include epileptiform spikes, which suggest a focal mechanism is at play in a patient with a clinical diagnosis of epilepsy or seizures. These spikes are not just random events. They are significant indicators of where the brain's abnormal electric activity is concentrated. The polarity of these spikes is often negative when observed on the surface of the scalp EEG, and they typically have a duration of 20 to 70 milliseconds. This duration is crucial because spikes shorter than 20 milliseconds raise suspicion for non-cerebral potentials, such as artifacts generated by muscle activity. Now, these spikes may or may not be followed by an aftergoing slow wave discharge. This slow wave is often seen as part of the IED complex, but its absence doesn't necessarily diminish the significance of the spike itself. The location of these discharges plays a vital role in determining their potential for epileptogenicity. For instance, IEDs originating from the temporal lobe are strongly associated with a higher risk of clinical seizure expression. This is particularly important when we consider seizure semiology, the clinical features and behaviors associated with seizures. Anterior temporal IEDs, for example, are often linked to focal seizures of temporal lobe origin. These focal seizures can manifest in various ways, depending on the precise location and extent of the epileptiform activity within the temporal lobe. So to sum it up, Focal IEDs, especially those originating in the temporal lobe, are key indicators in the diagnosis and management of epilepsy. Their duration, polarity, and location all contribute to their significance in clinical practice. Now, before we fully wrap up, let's quickly recap the four key points from today's discussion. Focal IEDs, localized epileptiform discharges indicating a focal mechanism in epilepsy. Polarity and duration, typically negative polarity on scalp EEG with a duration of 20 to 70 milliseconds. Location and epileptogenicity. Temporal lobe IEDs are highly associated with clinical seizure expression. Seizure semiology. Anterior temporal IEDs are linked to temporal lobe origin focal seizures. And that's it for today. Hey, here's another video on EEG pattern recognition.